last August, everything was going well for the Avalos family. Their older daughter was starting her last year of high school. Their son was beginning his final year of middle school, and the younger daughter was starting her last year in elementary school. Everything was right on schedule. Then, then the younger daughter was diagnosed with a serious illness, and suddenly everything changed. Let's meet the younger daughter. Hi, my name is Josh. And I'm going to get a little bit of 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 I made this bread, um, this cake. It's oh, a chocolate cake. It's a chocolate cake. When did you make it? Today. Oh wow! How did you do it? What did you put in it? Flour, sugar, cocoa powder, mm. milk. Water. And do you remember the most important ingredient in anything you make? You know what that is? The love. What else you like to do, Joshua? Paint. Okay. What do you paint? Maybe we can take a look at some of the pictures you paint? Let's do that, okay? Which one is your favorite? How come? No, actually that one. That's your favorite, okay? The Christmas one? Yeah, I made that for my mom for Christmas. If you could change one thing in the world, make it different, mm -hmm. how would you change the world? Maybe a cure for cancer. You think they've been trying to do that for a long time? That's a big job, a cure for cancer. Tell me why you go to the doctor. Oh, because I have a brain tumor. Oh, wow. Where did you find out about this? August. How did you know you had a brain tumor? Or how did they find out that you had it in the first place? Because I saw it in my head and my mom took me to the hospital. And? What did they do? They did an MRI. Joshley has a type of brain tumor known as diffuse intrinsic pantine glioma, commonly referred to as DIPG. According to mainstream medicine, DIPG has a survival rate of zero and is considered terminal upon diagnosis. In more than 40 years of research, no progress has been made in finding a cure for this disease. Looking at the chart for survival rates of childhood cancers, the rates range from, from 64 to 97 percent for all cancers except DIPG, which has a survival rate of zero. With DIPG, surgery is not an option. The benefits of radiation are temporary, and chemotherapy has no positive impact. Because mainstream medicine offers no solutions, families turn to alternative medicines. While these alternatives can be helpful in fighting cancer, they are very expensive and medical insurance does not cover any of the cost. Doctors and hospitals have facts and statistics, but Jesus has the truth and God has the final word. Are you afraid right now? No, because no. Jesus cannot cure me. I ask you to consider Josh Lee and her family in two ways. First, please pray for Josh Lee and for her parents. Every prayer and kind thought is deeply appreciated. Second, please help Joshley and her family financially. Anything you can give, no matter how small, will help. Thank you for taking time to view this video. Thank you for your prayers and for any financial help you can offer. You can make donations through the GoFundMe website. The name of the campaign is Please Help Joshley.